Today we are doing track day prep and washing the cars. So we figured we would do a review on the Griot's Garage Garden Hose Foam Sprayer. And just throwing some of the chemical guys snow foam auto wash in it. And then we will fill it up the rest of the way with some water and start washing. Give you guys a little bit of a review. So as you can see, it foams up a little bit, but it's not that nice, heavy shaving cream foam that you really want when you're washing a car. It'll still get the job done. It's just super watery. We did 500 milliliters of the snow foam and it's practically gone. The only way to get it to keep foaming is you have to mix it, but it also leaks out of the top when you try to mix it. So watch out for that. But when you're using it, it's best to go from bottom to top, just so you can make sure and see what parts you have or haven't hit. Well, the Never King Pose is pink. You should do a review on that too. <laughs> We haven't even done a whole half of the car and it's already pretty much water. So I'd say for the money, if I remember correctly, it was like 40 or 50 bucks. Look, it's all water. So now we got to fill it up again. But it was like 40 or $50 on Amazon. I think it's $50 from Griot's themselves. To me, it's not worth it, especially if you have a pressure washer do like the chemical guys i have one on the way i'll do a review on that i've used my dad's and i know i like it so we'll do a review on that but for now we're just going to try to finish up washing the car try to do some b-roll for you guys fine and then if we find anything that works for it we will let you know but as you can see it's just all water that's left so hopefully by the time we wash alex's golf we'll have this figured out checking to see if Alex has any different techniques that work for using this. So far, same issue, get about halfway done, if that, and then it just turns into water again. So now he's over here filling it. Make sure my app looks good. No comment. So who's gonna be faster tomorrow, Alex? The Golf or the 8.6? Probably the 8.6, you got a little bit more power than I do, but I don't know about handling, we'll see. Yeah, your car's actually modified. <laughs> hey, it's only suspension and tires, so you got some stuff on me as well, specifically from the factory. Yeah. Whereas mine was essentially shot from the factory because of how shitty the suspension was on. <laughs> Yeah, you'll be in the front wheel drive class. I'll be in rear wheel drive. I've never auto crossed a rear wheel drive car before, so we'll see how it goes. But should be fun. It's definitely going to be way different than when I took the Veloster out. It's got less power than the Veloster had. So we'll see. We're pretty much done with prepping. We got to load up the two cars with all of our tools and everything and once the cars are loaded up we'll just call it a night hang out try to come up with a game plan see if there's anything we forgot anything we need to pick up run the last couple of errands and then we will see you guys at the track <laughs> 